Family owned and operated Bluegrass Restoration and Construction is a full service construction company offering full service home maintenance with 24 7 emergency services. All services performed in house with no subcontractors. Give them a call at 859 353 1133. From the Madison HVAC Weather Center, I'm meteorologist Susie Martin. Thank you so much, Grendelin. As we look at the past five days, we have certainly been very, very warm, especially Thursday and Friday of last week, where we we're 20 degrees plus above the average and even pretty mild this weekend, despite the cooler temperatures. Well, I'm here to inform you that this week, solid cold arrives, the coldest temperatures of the season. We've had a mixed bag of sun and clouds today. We are looking at fairly tame weather through the day tomorrow, but the cold is what's going to be hitting us. Snowflakes, even a possibility this week, and then an unsettled end to the week. By the way, it's Winter Weather Awareness Week, so we'll be showcasing some safety tips for you each and every day here. Thinking about your car and winter storm preparations, here's some things that you can do to prepare for the season ahead, and we just urge you to take all the precautions, especially if you're driving in winter weather. Just remember to take it snow, slow. Now, we don't have any major storms to talk about winter-wise just yet, but there is a potential for some snowflakes. So let's go ahead and take a look at the forecast ahead. We have increasing clouds that that will be building and then we have a weaker disturbance that will be sinking in from the Great Plains and this will be interacting with the cold enough air to support maybe a brief wintry mix situation, maybe even some snowflakes early or Wednesday morning, but it's in and out of here in a hurry, so it doesn't have really the opportunity to crank out a significant amount of uh, accumulating snow we're thinking, but as far as rain goes about a quarter of an inch to about a third of an inch or more possible accumulations at this moment are not likely, though you can see Frenchburg maybe a light coating there, but we'll continue to fine tune this uh, forecast for you, of course, as we know more. We do have our overnight lows down into the 20s and looking at the day ahead tomorrow an early breakdown, it is going to be chilly. Temperatures will be building only into the 30s. So here you go. Here's that cold I'm talking about. Highs at around 38 in Richmond, 38 in Lancaster. Very chilly indeed. Our extended forecast showcasing some more showers, the warmer weather later this week. That's your greater Richmond area of weather forecast. Thanks for watching.